Hello right, guys and uh, welcome back to another video from uh, the beautiful Boracays in the Philippines. Today in this video I just wanted to show you something really spectacular about this island and that is the sunset. If I turn my camera around I'll show you what I mean. Now this is a, a well-known, I guess the things to see, look at, the sunset here and if you think this is pretty, just wait for it. So all these sailboats over there, very soon, or I think they already are making their way, they'll be heading over to this direction as the sun's setting over the horizon and into the whatever the respected docks are for the harbour but the view looks amazing and those uh, parasailings back there that's uh, sunset special parasail as well so you can do it in a day but you can also come and do it sunset so obviously if you're up in one of those you will have the sunset for longer than if you were standing where I am on the land because you obviously a little bit up and your horizon for you is extended a bit further out. The winds are a lot, lot more calmer, lot much calmer than this afternoon. Uh, there's still a bit of breeze, uh, as you can see the leaves here, they're moving around a bit. So what I'll do is I'll walk to, I'll show you around first here. So this is called the White Beach. In my video yesterday, if you haven't seen that one, I was explaining Ireland is split, not split, but I would say for tourism purposes. Station one, which is further past that cliff. And then station two is where you see those blue sails. I think all the way, pretty much somewhere here roughly. And then from here onwards, all the way to where the other edge of the cliff is, is Ireland. Three, oh, station three. So this is really packed. Those clear boats, they, um, they're also very famous. You see a lot of people taking these boats out. So these guys, they paddle it for you. And because they're clear, you see the bottom of the bottom of the ocean, the water, pretty cool photo. It's a lot busier and packed than this was this morning. Obviously when it's hot, there's not many people here. Water today was uh, relatively colder than yesterday because I'm guessing because of the wind and stuff. It's a bit of a struggle to walk on the sand. Shoes on. Boy, got him. It's a good vibe here. All these restaurants, bars, they started to pop. Here is the sun setting. Slowly. Like the scene's gonna look absolutely stunning once those sailboats are making their way. Just wait for it. You won't regret it. We got all these shops here on the side of the road, as you would expect at a similar kind of location, destination. And then you have these the sand castles. I'm guessing you just pay them to get a photo, so that's a reward for them to make this one. They um 
They do make them on the other side as well. On the, and I think that was a better one. With this one here, it's good. It's good, but the other one is better. Um, the reason for that is because he just literally drawn the date or the text into the sand where the other guy had made it like a, how do I say, like a 3D kind of, you know, the floating kind of characters or letters. So I think that's a bit of a, bit of a skill. Not saying this is bad, but that was even better. So you do have a lifeguards here spread out throughout this beach. I was saying yesterday in my video, this island is really safe. There's a lot of police, a lot of security guards. And um, the lifeguards on the, on the, on the beach. I haven't seen many dogs here and uh, look at that doggy there. They do have a lot of cats here. Whoa! Almost got it, nah, nah. I tried. It's been a while, my skills are of catching discs. It's definitely worn off. There you go, the police here, the tourist police. So this side is station three, it's a, a lot, not a lot, but definitely calmer or quieter than the other station. Station two is the most busiest, where station one is, I think it's heaps quieter. I think out of three, the station one is the most quiet, quieter one, I think. But it's further out past that cliff as well, so. It's a bit secluded, good in a way, but if you, I think first timer like me, it's better to just hang around so you can maneuver around, have all these facilities. Uh, the sound, all the music isn't too bad here. Today's Friday, although, so it could be different, um, but so far, haven't had any dramas. Um, when I was in PP Islands, that was, Ridiculous, but it's not too bad. There it is, let's turn it around. I think uh, the time at the moment is 5.36 and I'm pretty sure sun sets in probably 10, 15 minutes. So I won't bore you with that one. What I'll do is I'll, I'll continue as soon as the the boats are sailing back in. So you get to enjoy the sunset. I swear to God, when I said initially, those sailboats gonna be passing this sun as it's setting down over the horizon, I did not lie. And I know it did not happen. I'm not sure why, from the last two days, that's what's been happening. And of course, when I'm making this video, <laughs> it just didn't happen. Um, I don't know if it's the wind direction or something, but anyway, it didn't happen but you know what I will I'll capture that I'll make sure I'll I'm here for another few days anyway almost a week so there'll be another opportunity to capture that anyway still looks pretty I'm sure you guys enjoyed the beautiful sunset in Boracay Oh, there are a few sailboats there docking back and nightlife has definitely picked up. What a pleasant evening. There's still a lot of people out in the ocean and it doesn't really get deep like I'm, I think a good 50 meters. Uh, the waters are definitely under six feet. Oh, can't say about the whole beach, but what I've seen so far.
Oh, yeah, someone's just getting buried. I'm not sure why, but none of those, none, none, but all these sailboats usually come out and started to go towards to the left and it looks amazing like you see the sun setting behind him it looks like magnificent i'm sure we'll capture it another time oh, this was good as well Alright guys, so that was it. That was uh, the beautiful sunset at the Boracay's. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up. New to the channel, make sure you subscribe and uh, press that bell icon so you get the notification uh, when I post the next video. Other than that, any questions, comment, complaints, put it down below. And there'll be more stuff coming up, so stay tuned for that one. I'll be making some spontaneous decisions as to as to my next travel plans which i'm kind of excited before i was a bit not scared but concerned but being in philippines definitely it's a safe country very safe country and i think i can definitely make on the spot plans because language is not an issue here and it's it's well safe uh, everyone's pretty kind very friendly so see you in those videos until then goodbye and take care have a last glimpse. This part is packed.